I'm Kristen Smith. I'm an independent consultant with Lilla Rose, and today I want to show you how I can do six different hairstyles with six out of the seven sizes of flexi clips. Now, you may be wondering if there are seven sizes of the flexi, why can I not do six, seven styles with seven sizes? And the reason is because our largest flexi clip called the Mega is mega big, and I don't have enough hair for it. My my hair is average thickness, it's pretty long, but it takes a tremendous amount of hair to fill up a mega, and I don't have it. So you'll see me use sizes mini through extra large, and I'm going to whip through these styles really fast and you'll see how quickly you can use a flexi clip. And you'll also get a feel for maybe what size you would need depending on how your hair compares with mine. So flexi clips come in sizes mini, extra small, small, medium, large, extra large, mega. And that's one of the things that makes them so great is with the different sizes, there's a size that'll work for your hairstyle, texture, and length. Um, and so it makes them really wonderful. I'm gonna spin around and I'm gonna stay turned around while I do the hairstyles. If I spin back and forth, I'll get dizzy. We don't want that. That would be a YouTube blooper. So I'm gonna spin around and start with the mini clip. Okay, for me to use a mini, I can pull back the top part of my hair here. I'm just gonna loosely gather it. Grab my mini clip. I'm putting in a mini Celtic knot. And the Celtic knot is one of our very popular styles. And I actually have a little too much hair, so that's easy to fix. I just pull some of the hair from underneath out. The pin goes under, the pretty part bends over. And there, that's the top of my hair back and a Celtic knot mini clip. Take it out just by pulling on the pin. And now I'll move on to an extra small. For an extra small, I gather all the top part of my hair up for kind of a typical half up. Clip's gonna go in the same way with the pin under, bending the pretty part over. Pin slides through, and that's an extra small and a half up. Pull the pin out. Move on to the next style. Next one, I'm just gonna do a basic ponytail with a small clip. And this small clip is a freestyle tiara, and it's one of our most popular clips. There's a basic ponytail. So much prettier than just a elastic hair tie. Okay, now I'm gonna start wrapping my hair for a drop bun. And a drop bun, is styled just kind of how it sounds. Now I'm gonna do this fast, so there'll probably be ends sticking out, but that's okay. So I do this first loop here, like a bun, and now instead of circling around and making it wider, I'm gonna pull this out and wrap around the base of that twist and let the bun part hang down for what I call drop bun. I do my hair like this a lot. And for this style, I usually poke the pin through and just kind of weave it in a little bit and catch some of the hair along the scalp. Pretty part bends over, pin slides through. And that is a drop bun with a medium. And this is a multicolor cluster clip. Okay, next for a large. This is how I wear my hair almost daily. And I'm gonna twist it around similar to what I did with the drop bun, but instead of letting it hang down, I'm gonna secure it up along my scalp with the rest of my hair. So I do lots of twisting and just fold it up instead of leaving it down. Grab my large clip. This is a festive leaf clip, a fallen leaf clip, and it's really pretty for fall. And there, that's a large. It pops out. And on to the last size that I can use. I'm gonna use an extra large clip for a round bun. And I twist and twist and twist my hair. Similar to the last two styles I just did. Wrap it around once, and then I like to hold the bun flat up against my head while I keep twisting. And that just, uh, I think makes it easier for the clip to go in. This is an open flower jet. I'm gonna slide this pin along my scalp, catching the hair along there and going right under the middle of the bun. Fold the pretty part over, push the pin through, and there's an extra large in a bun. 
And that's it, pretty easy. And you'll find that uh, with just a little bit of practice, you'll be able to use a flexi clip as quickly and easily as I just did. If you've never tried a flexi clip before, if you're new to Lilla Rose, I would love to help introduce you to them as an independent consultant. You can get in touch with me on my website, which is www.lillarose.biz backslash smithspirations. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day.